past few weeks, as you all know, I have been doing lots and lots of creation videos, so I thought that this week I would take a break from the creation videos and finally do a talking video and a kind of one to one because I haven't done one in a while and I kind of miss it. I kind of miss just conversing with you guys and discussing things. So talking about discussing things, I thought it would be really cool to discuss some of my favourite things in relation to creativity. So for this video I'm going to be discussing five favourite things. Firstly is a favourite book, a favourite art material that I've been using, a favourite movie that I've seen, a favourite song, or album or artist and a favourite new YouTuber who I have just discovered. Let's get to the favourites. So number one is my favourite book. Now if you were following me on Instagram, I did post a picture of a book that I bought from this awesome bookshop called Kinokuniya and it is the most magical place ever. I found this book called A Thousand Portrait Illustrations by Julia Shon, Shon Lao? Shon Lao? I hope I said that right. Whoa. It is mind-blowingly awesome. So this book, oh, ow. They've basically just chosen a whole bunch of artists are showing their work and their style and their portraits that they've done. So one artist in particular that I want to mention, and it's quite interesting because I was looking online at artists and I found this French lady who did these amazing illustrations and they were just, they were so cool, they were watercolour and I think she outlines them with pencil and I was like whoa, so I searched her on Twitter and I followed her and I'm like I love your work and she responded and she was like thank you so much and then whilst I was reading this book I opened up to this page and ta-da, she is actually in this book and her name is Elodie and she's from France and she does these incredible, I don't know if you can see, incredible illustrations. They are just absolutely awesome. So I will leave a link below down to her website and her Twitter so you guys should go follow her because she is an incredible artist and her work is really inspiring and hopefully it will inspire you to try out something new. So yeah, I really love this book because it's just got so many ideas and so much inspiration. It is kind of a pricey book but it is an investment and it's so nice to have an actual book of inspiration as opposed to just browsing online and stuff. If you guys are lacking inspiration or want something really interesting and oh, eye-opening and amazing to read and if you love portraits, if you love art, you will love this book so there it is. Second favourite which is an arty thing. So for the past week I have been really really getting into Faber-Castell Art Grip Aquarelle and basically they're like colour pencils but then you can add water to them and they become watercolours. You can use them as watercolours, you can use them as colour pencils, you can do both. What I would suggest is that you definitely invest in some watercolour paper if you're going to do watercolours because if you don't, normal paper tends to go all bumpy when water is added and then just have really bumpy paper afterwards and you don't really want that. Definitely give these a try because they're really cool and you will see them in upcoming creations. I think next week's creation might have these in them. Okay, now favourite number three is my favourite movie and I have to say my favourite movie that I've seen recently has to, oh, oh, it's difficult actually. Okay, I think it's quite an old movie, but it's such a cute romantic movie and it's called Kate and Leopold and it stars Meg Ryan and Hugh Jackman and it is just adorable. I will leave an IMDB below so you can go read about it and if you love anything kind of cutesy and romantic, just want a feel good movie, definitely go watch that because it's so, so cute. I'm not going to give the plot away because you'll just have to watch it to see what happens but it's such a lovely movie. So actually that leads me on to number four which is my favourite music at the moment and that has to be the Thor soundtrack because it is just incredible. That was probably one of my favourite things about the movie as well as Thor 
was the soundtrack and the soundtrack is actually by was composed by a guy called Brian Tyler and he is an incredibly incredibly successful and amazing composer and I will leave a link of his website down below. Go check him out and go see what other movies he's composed music for because you may be surprised he has composed music for a lot of things and he is an awesome guy. So my fifth favourite is a new YouTube movie I've discovered and her name is Lex and she has a YouTube channel called Major Look or made you look by Lex. I'll leave a link of that down below. She has a YouTube channel where she does these incredible, incredibly awesome makeup and costume paint. A lot of the time she creates her own looks. She also does makeup tutorials. She also promotes awareness about diabetes and even if you're not diabetic, I think it's really, really important to be aware of it in case any of your friends or family are diabetic and you know what to do, you know what to look for. And it's really nice to see someone using their YouTube channel in that way to help promote awareness, to help educate people, and also to just make others feel like they're not alone. So I really like that about the channel as well. And yeah, she's really cool. So I'll leave a link of that below. Check it out if you want to, which I really suggest that you should, because it's awesome. Yes. And I also have a special announcement where I have actually just released a website where you can go and I'm now offering commissions so if you guys want your own made creation Christmas is coming up and if you want to give something special to your family or one of your friends then I think a portrait or a picture is something really lovely that you could give to your family or friend and so if you want to do that then just head over to the website a link will be down below and I will do my best to try and help you out. So now that I've discussed my five favourite things, I would love you guys to share some of your favourite things. So pick five things that you have loved anytime, this month, last month, anything. Just pick five things and leave them in the comments down below and maybe we can all share and learn and enjoy other people's favorite things go do that now and if you liked this video i'd love it if you gave it a big thumbs up and again if you're not subscribed i bring out creation videos and just videos in general every single wednesday and sometimes in between links to all my social media places are down below so if you'd like to see behind the scenes or sneak peeks of things to come or just general daily life things then go and like and follow and subscribe to those. I don't know what I'm doing. And next week I have a little bit of an exciting kind of different creation. I know I say that every time but this one is going to be different I promise. So stay tuned for that. I will stop babbling because I don't know what I'm saying. So I will see you guys next week or sooner. Who knows? And as always, stay positive, stay creative, and have an absolutely wonderful day, night, morning, evening. Just have an absolutely awesome everything. Bye!